Welcome back to Daisy. Previously on our adventure in the server. On our first day, we had snowballed to riches after a lucky raid. And after building a base north of Severo, we quickly learned about our neighbors who made this city the kill zone. And so we made it a mission to deal with them. And once we raided their base, the safety of ours was threatened. <laughs> where you live. So that leads us to now. A lone man with building supplies on a mission to relocate and build a fortress. And so I arrived in Grishino, where I knew of the perfect spot with the building and space to expand. Here we go. Ah, oh, all safe and sound. Okay, now to get all of the stuff from the other base and transfer it here, which is going to take a long time, but it's got to be done. Oh, Kalinovka is actually where we built the church, just north of Severo. So I can kill two birds with one stone and go do that mission and grab some extra loot. Alright, we are in the mission zone. Um, if you look at my health, I did kind of crash uh, on the way back up north, but that's okay. The car is fine, I did manage to repair it with the spear radiator, but if I crash it again, we're screwed. Ooh, nails is really good. What do we have in here? And raid tools. Actually very good. Back to base we go. <clears throat> well, as you will know, I am a fantastic driver in DayZ. And I did end up crashing one more time. And this time the adder is out of commission. But regardless, uh, I'm back with another load of loot. And I'm going to call it for the night once I stash all this away. And hopefully we're not raided by the morning. But I doubt we will be. So what I want to do tomorrow is when I wake up is uh, go see if the neighbors are online. The guys that live in the church in Grishino. And see if they're friendly. And maybe we could form some sort of alliance. Because I think that would be nice. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go stash this loot away. And then call it for the night. Now before we continue with the journey we have a quick word from our sponsor. Factor. Factor is a service that provides fresh, delicious, ready-made meals right to your doorstep. Factor's chef-created meals are perfect to save yourself time in the kitchen and more doing what you really want. <clears throat> now, I've found Factor to be a huge time saver because I don't need to worry about prep, dishes, and planning about what ingredients I'll need or what to cook throughout the week. Now, I've said this before, but to achieve the most out of your fitness and gymming, you need to eat right because not only will you see a greater improvement on your body, you'll also have more energy and overall feel better throughout your day. And Factor is perfect for this because their meals are designed by a dietitian to provide you with premium, science-backed, nutritional quality. Factor also offers the freedom of flexibility to fit your lifestyle, whether you're choosing to go vegan or start a keto diet, Factor offers a variety of preference options and more than 27 meal options each week. So, don't just take my word for it. Use my link or go to go.factor75.com and use my code POGBARBARJAN60 for 60% off your first box. Once you click, my description will live update to count up the orders. Thank you again to Factor for sponsoring this video. For day two of our new beginning, Chopper and I use the rest of our resources to build the foundations of the perimeter. There's gonna be a watchtower here. Watchtower here. And then there's gonna be an airlock here. And after, he exited the journey to embark on another. And so, our solo endeavor to build a fortress begins here. Okay, well, I just got back doing a haul from Navaya. Um, so I'm going to run back to base, stash this loot. And then what we're going to do is hopefully try catch whoever lives in the church at Grishino. Um, and have a chat and see if they want to make an alliance. Because uh, I did see a Bambi flag that popped out of their roof. So I'm assuming they're friendlies. If they're not, then we kind of have a story as well, but it would be cool 
to have some some allies. Oh, don't tip me. Don't tip me with all this loot on me. Okay, I'm tempted. I didn't hear any snaps in my direction, so I think the guy that was shooting was not shooting uh, my way. Oh. One down. I think he was alone. Nails, okay. And we made it home. How good. Um, I'm gonna quickly, yeah, I'm gonna sort out the inventory stuff. And then I will be back to do some building. So you'll get an epic montage, of course. Okay, I'm officially out of nails. So, the next thing on my things to do list is to head over to the Grishino Church and see if they're home. Yo. Anyone home? Somebody talking? Oh, what's up, man? Oh, hey. Yo. This is the second dude that's come by in like 10 minutes. Let's go. Right. What's your name in game? Uh, I don't know if I want to give that away just yet. Are you Source? Someone was saying they have a Bambi flag, and I just assumed this was you. No. <laughs> uh, I don't know if that was convincing or not. I, I, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, but, uh... Uh, I just wanted to say, I do live in Grishino, and I I wanted to know if you wanted to be allies. Like, like good neighbors? Yeah, I, I, I could do that. What's your in-game name? Uh, Roman Sandals? I'll type in chat for you. You're Roman! Oh! Yeah, no, I just assumed this was you, no. since he said you had the deer flag. Yeah, it is. It's me. Okay, Here, okay. I'll type in chat so you can tell, too. Gotcha. Okay, well, that's good to know. Um, hey, uh, I'm, I'm starting an indoor farm here. I got a couple of planters, so if you guys ever need some extra food, just give me, like, a 20-minute warning. I could start making some... Uh, oh, that's fantastic. Like, zucchini, tomatoes. Yeah, yeah. No. All right, I, I'm going to hit off yeah, and I'll just literally see if I can course. fight some people yeah. and whatnot, but it was nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, go north, then. Sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> Take care. Well, wow. okay. Nice guy. Uh, I'm kind of glad I didn't find a pen to put a note on his door, because I think that was a lot more wholesome than me just putting a note and him being like, Huh? Who left this? <laughs> for the rest of the night, I scoured the lands for nails, while also searching for bases I could potentially start a feud with. Okay, he's definitely home. Hit him once. Alright, we'll, we'll leave for now. He's not gonna leave. Bash, eardrop. Oh. Anyone behind him? What the... How did that... I'm sorry, that first guy should have died, bro. Okay. Mission time. Um, I think all we have to do is free the pigs. Oh my god, here they are. Be free. Now where's the goodies? What are you doing? <laughs> oh, an M4 though. And a foul, these guys are juiced. Okay, day three. 
Um, as you can tell, it is now winter in the land of Tanaris. It's still the same server, just literally 8 hours difference from when I last logged out. Ooh. Oh. So the fight was... Okay, there's a body there. Yeah, the fight was definitely here. Oh my god. MBGs. Food. Thank you. Alright. I hear bodies in here, man. SVD. Okay, all of these guys are juiced. Now, I'm gonna go depot. Huh. There's a fire in Gashino, just at the house. Hey, buddy. Are you cooking in there? Oh, I see him. Okay, so they left for sure. There's two of them. Oh, God. Where did this guy go? Oh, there he is. Oh, my God, in four. And nails. Okay, I don't feel so bad about killing these guys now. And you know, honestly, this guy is foot wraps. So you know he's been ratting around. All sneaky like. I don't feel so bad. It is crazy how much power you have having an MBG scope at night. You feel like the Predator. Our compound is finally secure. How good. Look at that. Okay. Now we need to start the big hunt for nails. Just to get this outer wall completely planked up. And that way I'm not going to get sniped in. And it also is a lot harder for them to get through. Alright. I am returning to Vibor. Because, one, I've heard a few shots from here. I think there is a base and piano just south of Vibor. And also one in the center of it. So I'm hoping I can kind of come into a fight between the three or whoever is fighting here. For two, it's really the only base that I've really found that's been active uh, when I've been around. So I'm hoping that they are online. Um, from what I can see, actually, there are chopped down trees because there should be a lot more orange trees peeking out from the compound of the Vibor Industrial, so I'm pretty sure they're online. Oh my, they have expanded a lot. Where was the fight, though? Okay. I'm gonna try to find them. I think they own this base at the school here. Oh my. He threw an. Holy shit, my health. Okay, I think he's dead. Holy. I did not realize he threw a nade. That did so much damage. Okay. Well, well, well. 
Uh, a bit of deja vu here, but I am returning to Vibor because I do want to retrieve some of my gear. Now, when I went back after I died, the foul was already found. And what I think happened is I fought the guys from the base at the school in the center of Vibor. Uh, and then someone from Industrial third partied that fight. Because I did see a guy in the double green window when I rewatched the footage. So, all I'm hoping for here is a bit of revenge. Alright, buddy. Yeah. Oh, no way. He's going back into Vibor. <laughs> I definitely think this was these were the guys that killed me. Oh. Okay. His friend's gonna come back for sure. There's one inside the base too. Tried it. Okay, not much on this guy. Let's get out of here. Honestly, successful mission. Uh, we got an M4 and an SVD. Also, vengeance. The next day, I decided to have another crack at the Vibor Industrial Clan. But this time, I wanted to see if we could find an opening and potentially raid them. So I rounded together Source and his friend Zephos, and as a trio, we set off to investigate their door count. Hey, come on in. We got tomatoes. We just got <laughs> Very good, very good. There we go. Okay, we're ready. Alright, set it. So is base inside industrial? You'll see it. It'll be the one in front of the sewing factory. Yeah, cut down trees. Oh. Easy, easy. The building. Okay, yeah. They got a big compound now. They're coming out. One's out. You got him? I had him. I think he's uncon. I can kind of see inside. They got a canvas tent, two canvas tents, a military tent, a green medium. Can you tell him any doors? Uh, it's hard to tell. Okay. If I was on the opposite side, I could definitely tell. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to try and piss this guy off. Hey man, I just want to go in there. I want I want some food. Give me some food, dude. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I wanted to see what all the hoopla was about this monster base that I heard about. And to be honest, I'm not impressed. No. No, no, no. Let's just say it's just you and me in this area, just us. And how about this? We make a uh, we make a pact. We, we we have a duel. I'm dead. Jesus Christ! I, I just wrote, fucking noticed. Look at the fucking uh, famous behind his ass. Oh, I saw the famous. Yeah. What the fuck? You can take it if you want. I I, I genuinely don't <laughs> like it. You don't like it? No. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. If you want it. Well, it's your gun, no? You can take it, bro. I, I don't like the no, gun. No, 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 no. I, I like the M16. Uh, Zeph's got an AUG back at base that he's been like currently in. Hiding. <laughs> oh, right, okay, okay. It. Yeah, fair, fair. Yeah. Yeah, take the fa- yeah. yeah, you got it? There's there's extra mags in the in the wall as well. Maybe we approach it from this side? In the left corner of room, just in case. Yeah, let me ping where I saw the guy, by the way. Right there. In oh, that the window. Crack, I see it. Honestly, I just need him to peek and he's dead. Coral. He's talking. He's talking. <laughs> so sweaty, Coral. 
this really Rick Grimes' base? I found, I found the guy that, that knows why Daryl has such ultimate riz. Oh my god. You shot my friend. Yeah, apologize in global chat right fucking now. I'm you know what? Liar? I, know I know you're the guy that, that, you're the guy that loaded out here. here. I know you are. Guys, we know where you are. He's dead or nice. I don't know. He's on con for sure. What to Carl? Or dead. Uh, can you please let me in? I really just want to see your base. You could shoot me. I just really your want buddy. to see you. I will your, your buddy will put it. away I, I will put away my gun. F five. Wow, you're trying you're trying to count our doors. doors. No. No I'm not. Yeah. How many doors? How many how many, how many, do, you many do you think we have? Let's, Let's play, play this game. game. How many do you think we have? Say, I'm gonna say four gates and maybe four doors? For gates. <laughs> for gates. For gates. And then, and then you That's got it? double doors. I believe oh, them when they say they have more than four house. doors, so. That's a problem. I could teach you how to farm. Do you have a greenhouse? <laughs> no, we don't have a greenhouse. We should go, bro. Yeah. Yeah, time, to go. time to go. Time to go. So, are we going into town? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna get pinched. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go into this area right here real quick. Oh. oh shut up. Yeah. Yeah. Back up a little. Back up a little. Okay, you guys stay back there. I'm gonna be at the. Two guys in front of us? Or behind? I'm still on the open. They both are. They gotta be. Shit, I'm not even up, guys. Are you uncle? No, I'm gonna do this. I'm flanking. I'm flanking. No, no, I'm dead. One's at the barn. Yeah. I see him. At the fence line. Two of them. One dead. One, one on con. One on con. Both dead. Oh. No, one still alive. Oh no, 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 he's still alive. One more at the barn. On con, on con. Nice. This bridge should be around. Dead. Just taking the bodies. Nails, oh, I, I see this guy. Where? Ping it. He's, he's hurt? He might be dead. I'll be there in a second. He had 100 nails. He's got nails for days. We should. Beautiful. We should get this out of here. I, I heard two distinct people. They've, I feel like there should have been more people. Like, we should have been surrounded and killed. Yeah. Especially when you were looting, bro. There's no way you got away with that. Okay, well, it's a good thing we did investigate the Viper Industrial Base because it turns out we probably wouldn't have enough boom to get through their doors just because of how rapidly they're building and growing. Um, but that's okay. At least we got like 150 nails or something from them when we killed them at the end there. But now I'm checking out the castle just south of Altar because I believe this base has expanded quite a bit. So if they're active and online right now, we could get a raid out of them. So I'm just going to see how many doors they have and then I'm going to go back, get source, and we'll tear this thing down. Is that a gate? It is not a gate. Is it not a door there? It might just be one and then we can cheese the rest. Okay. Um, source just said someone was just outside his base. Oh, I see him. I think. I do see him. Hey buddy, in the house over there, with the penis helmet, are you friendly? Hello? You want to surrender or are you going to you wanna fight it out? Hands up! Hands up, man! Hands up! No, no, he's up. <laughs> hey, kill him! Okay, bro. Dude, oh, we had a box of nails. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> okay. It's time.
Okay, there is one more door. Huh? What? What? There's some Pokemon cards here for you, man. <laughs> Ooh, gotta catch a ball! I mean, it didn't look like they logged out with anything. Oh, there's a foul here. Beautiful. Hello, my name is Bong Ji. I'm currently being held against my will in a castle. I'm forced to transmit Chinese musical day. I'm sorry, losing my mind. I fear the worst. <laughs> okay. So these guys were bad people, you know? They were. Oh, box and nails. I think we're good for the base then. Uh, I think Bong Ji's trolling. I think he might be. I think, he might, I think he just might be. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that is. Oof. Okay. Yep, yeah, Sauce and I just split up. And what I'm going to do is get all this loot stored away. And I'm going to build up the rest of the walls as much as I can. I think I can get the outer perimeter done now, which is great. And then it's, uh, it's just watchtower from there. Oh. All right, this is the last panel I have to build for the outer perimeter. And we're done. Oh my god, it feels good. Look at that. Okay, that is beautiful. I'm very happy with this. Now, unfortunately, the next day was quite uneventful. And when I had logged on in the night, my base was raided. Now with no culprit and no note to follow up on, I just spent the next two days repairing and fortifying for an inevitable second raid. And almost exactly 48 hours from when I was first raided, I logged on in the night because Source sent me this message. Now I didn't think much of it at the time, but man was I lucky to get on at the perfect opportunity. What the fuck? Alright, I need Source to come. Oh my God. Please tell me he's dead. I, th I think I might be dead here. If there's another, I'm dead. Yo, 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 yo. Come, come, come to the base. You're in your base? They're, they've gotten through the entire thing. Okay, okay. Give me a second. Give me a second. I gotta get a okay. gun. Okay. Oh my God. There's three dead, bro. Holy, I wish I was recording as I was logging in. Because this guy was clueless. The one right in front of me at the locker was literally just looting and I had to drop my backpack, pull out the M4 and just yeah, spray him down. What I am going to do though is just wait for Source to come push the compound because there's a lot on the line. If you can make it inside to me, okay. yeah, I'm not, I'm going to lock this door. Uh, I took one of their uh, plate carriers. I'm going to, I'm going to clear the back for you. Okay. Oh. Is he is but oh no that's you that's you come to me if you can get inside Coming. Whoa, whoa, whoa. are you outside or inside no I'm inside I'm inside Got him. you're a beast bro with the Raiders dead all we needed to do now was secure the loot before they returned I need you to uh I need you to pick up this backpack with the coyote no the, the Alice where I'm aiming Oh, the Alice. Great. Yeah. Get that on, and then we're going to get it. out. To the church? Yep. I actually have a code lock on me if you want to code lock it quick. Wait, you, you do? Yeah, I do. I do. I have one from oh, earlier. Oh, my God, that's clutch. Oh, shit, it's on the other side. Perfect. Now, at least the loot is secure Sweet. for a little bit. Let's get out of here. Let's go. So it looks like you're moving in. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Rip that guy's plate carrier, but full. Oh. Because I was going around the back. You have this little gap between your fence on the backside and the doorway. Yeah. And I'm looking at this like form, and I'm like, is that a dead body? And then it starts to like twitch a bit. I'm like, oh shit. And I was thinking, is that you? It's like, no, 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 no. Like, <laughs> so I ripped him right in the back and he freaked out. I, I genuinely cannot believe I logged in on them like that. Thank you, bro. Whew. Thanks to the help of Source, I managed to keep the dream alive another day. And so I stashed the valuables in his base, and then I spent the rest of the night reinforcing the fortress once again. Oh, 
All right, well, it has been a week since that raid on my base, and as you can tell, I have done a bunch of work on the fortress. Now, unfortunately, nothing has really happened in this area for a long time, and it seems like a big group has monopolized a lot of the north uh, in Nevaya. So, my plan for the final act of this video is to just use up all my boom and hope we can get something from it, and then I want to find someone deserving to give this fortress to. Because at this point, I feel it's time for me to start a new journey and move on. And I think someone else can make good use of this base. And so, for the rest of the day, I roamed and I fought until I found that one target that I could use my boom on. Oh my god. Oh, there's like two people. Three? There's, there's literally one to my left in the tent too. Holy shit. And two- No way, bro. I need to get out of here. I'm gonna rush this guy in the tree. And if I survive, I'm gone. What an ambush. Oh. oh, so close, man. And well, just as I was about to investigate the west side of the map, I had died mysteriously just south of Krona Castle. And so, I think I may have found my target. Ah, <sighs> okay, let's get looking in the west side. And so, I begun my investigation. My first hunch was that whoever killed me said in side chat that they were on their way to northwest. Now, Krona to northwest is an odd loot route, which means they must have embarked on a loot run. Thus, their base was close to where I had died. Big base here. <laughs> oh, never mind. Yeah, this thing is looted. Now, there's this spot that I know is a base, but it's a little bit too small, I believe. It's probably one door. But there's an adder here. Oh. Uh, okay, this has no entrance. Hold, hold up, though. If this isn't raided, the flag's all the way up to the top. If this isn't rated, I think I might have found it. It's a guess, though. I mean, it could just very well be someone else's base, but I think the position is just too close to where I died. And I know for a fact Krona is rated. So literally everything in the vicinity is rated, except for that one up the hill, but that's too small, right? See, look, okay. So this is where I am. And I believe I died literally like around here. I'm telling you, this is probably the guys. Okay, well, I'm just going to commit. Uh, I'm going to head back to base and prepare. Uh, it is quite late right now, so I'm going to wait until raid time is off. And there's a lot more people in the server, so potentially I could catch them. So yeah. Alright, I'm getting the boom, and also I'm bringing all the parts I need to repair that adder up the hill. Because I think that will be really, really useful in transferring all the loot back to my base. Alright, here goes nothing. I really hope I don't get killed on the run there, because that would suck. Beautiful. Now all I need to do is not crash. It's time. 
Let's just get this baby down. Building supplies. Oh. Okay, I would have thought these doors on the inside would have been metal. And I brought heavies with me. Um, so I'm going to go back, grab the homemades, and return. Uh, this was about to happen. I'm out. Boom. Oh my god. Okay, average loot, just a lot of it. Now that's good. Oh my god. This is too much loot for a solo to take. Jesus. Uh, I hear someone outside. Yeah, he's close. Oh. Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna talk to him. Yo! What's up, buddy? Hello. Are you, are you by yourself? Hello. Yeah, kind of. What's your name, man? Ryu. Nice to meet you, Ryu. I'm Barney. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, are you by yourself too? I am by myself. Uh, uh, if you want, can you leave the town for now, and I'll and I'll message you inside chat, okay, okay. and you can come back and grab a okay. shit ton of gear. Is that okay? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Man. All right, man. So you uh, you have a base around here? I am raiding this guy. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah, I just started playing your DC few days back on it. Oh, okay. And well, I just started playing. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad I didn't kill you. <laughs> Alright, I'll get to you inside nice chat and I'll let you know. Okay. okay. Nice to meet you, man. Stay safe. Nice. That was crazy. Okay, I'm gonna head back to base, grab some raid screws, and also stash a bunch of the gear that I've already picked up. But I'm gonna leave this landmine here in case someone does wander in, or Ryu does come back and decide to try his luck. There's someone outside. Please don't be Ryu. Okay, I don't think that was him. Okay, raid done. Let's just get back home safe. Now, to stash all this loot. Okay, I think it is that time, boys. We have done all we can on the server, and now it's time for me to give it away. So I saw Ryu actually typing in chat about 
there being no space to build a base. And I've offered my base up to him, so if he does come here today, I will happily give him the codes and give him permission to the flag, and this is all his, including the loot as well. But man, I'm pretty proud. Look at this place. We did all this pretty much solo. I, I think Source helped a lot as well, um, in terms of just giving me metal and barbed wire and some nails and whatnot, but all the building, except for the fence post, of course, with Chopper setting that up, we did it. It's good. We built the fucking solo fortress. Here he is. Yo. What's up, bro? He's wearing the same outfit. How you doing? Yeah, it looked like it. There you go, man. Welcome. Good to be here. Well, the car is in working condition. Um, be careful of the claymore. You might want to destroy that in your own time. But don't be too close. <laughs> when you, uh, when you shoot it out. <laughs> there you go, man. Feel free to take some gear, make yourself at home, you know. Thanks a lot, man. So how long ago did you start playing? I started playing like... We bought Daisy uh, between these, uh, this month and this month only. Yeah, we started playing it in the Rearm server. That was a straight no-no. Yeah. You were the first friendly guy I met. Whenever I, I try to I try to talk to people and they'll almost uh, all of them, 99% of them, like, they kill on site. Awesome, man. Well, uh, enjoy the base. I'm going to log off for the night. You know all the codes, so... Make yourself at home. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Enjoy the base, man. Take whatever you need. All that gear in there is, is all yours. <laughs> Thanks a lot. No worries, man. Nice to meet you, bro. Nice Maybe I'll see you later. Yeah. See you. Oh, okay. That's it. And so, it is that time again. It was kind of a different change of pace for me, since, as you know, I don't build too much, and most of my bases are quite small. But I had a blast, and offloading the base to a person like that made it even better. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you're new here, consider subscribing. You can always change your mind later. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.